Governor Mark Dayton let a $260 million tax bill die overnight. It's called a pocket veto because he had until midnight to sign it into law and didn't. The bill included tax relief for farmers, college graduates, and parents with child care costs. But it also had a wording error in it that could have cost the state more than $100 million. Republican leaders accused the governor of holding the bill hostage during ongoing talks surrounding so, a potential you know, special session to complete unfinished work from the 2016 that. session. Dayton was holding out for Republicans to agree to extra money for university and transportation projects like the Southwest Light Rail Extension. WCCO will be at a news conference at 10 o'clock this morning where Dayton will talk about what comes next. At 1 this afternoon, the governor invited legislative leaders to meet with him privately. Stay with WCCO for continuing coverage.